What is up ladies and gentlemen? If you want some cheap and reliable coins, go to To My Game. It's in the description down below. Type in Rambos for a 5% discount. What is up ladies and gentlemen? Today I'm going to be showing you my 140k uh, Bundesliga mixed with Liga BBVA team. Now, first we have in goal Diego Alves. He is an absolute beast. He's worth 70, uh, 60, 67k, his normal car's about a k or so. Next player uh, in centre back is Dante. He is fucking insane on this game. He's worth a k and he's most certainly worth a k. Alright, he's a must in this whole hybrid. Next player we're going to go for is Pizcek. Pizcek, he is a strong right back. He's worth 5.4k and he holds the team together like you would not believe the next center back we have we're gonna go for Naldo now Naldo he is a insanely strong center back he links with uh, Dante so well and they play like absolute troopers he is uh, as I said 1.3k and he's definitely worth 1.3k in left back we have Marcelo this links the back four very well Marcelo he's the strongest left back in Liga B BBVA in my opinion he is a must buy for 17k uh, next we have in centre mid we have Iniesta Iniesta I've had in some other teams he's really played well I reckon he's an underrated and underpriced player he's 34k right now on the transfer market and you need to buy him in centre mid also we have Lam. he used to be a right back for the Bundesliga uh, in FC Bayern Munich, he's been upgraded to a centre mid and he's definitely worth it. He's strong and he links with our other centre mid who is Schweinsteiger, who is also underrated and underpriced. Well, maybe not underrated, but underpriced at 30k when he should be, in my opinion, 100, 100k or so. He is insane. In right wing, we have Muller. Uh, he links with Schweinsteiger really well and our, and our striker, who we're going to show you in a minute. He is 4.5k. And he is an absolute beast on the wing. Next, we have Tony Cruz's upgraded to cent uh, striker card from centre mid. Uh, you can pick this up for 8.5k. He's a really good striker. You would not uh, really uh, uh, believe it until you use him. In left wing, I've got uh, Pedro. His normal cards, I think, a K or so. But his inform, which is a must buy in my opinion, is 162k. This is my team, and we are up against. A BPL team who, in my opinion, was overrated. Uh, now we see Muller running up the wing, putting the ball in, and it was an insane save by his keeper, who I can't really remember his name. As you can see here, it should have been a penalty, which was the first of many EA bullshits in this game. We make a strong challenge at the back, and then he causes another dirty challenge on me, which it results in a free kick. Uh, and then we have a bit of attacking play from him who we defend and then bring it out into the attacking third of the pitch. Uh, it stops and he gets a through ball, a jammy through ball, which he takes past me and scores a pretty nice goal in my opinion. I think he scored it with Drogba. Anyways, here comes on to my attack. Uh, I think on the ball is Muller at the moment who puts a beautiful ball out to Pedro. And then Pedro runs it down the wing, puts it in. Uh, wait, no, he doesn't put it in, my opinion. Sorry, uh, he doesn't put it in. He just you know, loses the ball. Sick. Uh, we then get it back, but he gets it back again. Then we have Naldo have a long shot, which was not on target, but was still, as the commentator says, ambitious shot for a centre-back. Then we see William running up the wing, putting the ball into the middle, um, who... Can I just say Alves makes a nice save on nice and strong. His form is insane. Tony Cruz runs it in. He does a nice um, cutback kind of style thing. Can't really, I don't really know what it's called, but he does a beautiful, beautiful run there and a nice free kick, which his uh, his goalkeeper was in a good position for. Now he's he's on the attack, running up with Drogba. Drogba puts it into the back of the net again. Which was, I don't know, that half was kind of bullshit in my opinion. Anyways, moving on to the next half. Miller does a nice little run, but um, doesn't really continue to anything more. Then I reckon there should have been a free kick there because we did a nice uh, rainbow flick but nothing came off. As you can see here, we do a nice little one-two bit of play. Um, which is just showing how well this team does work together. Now, Schweinsteiger is on the ball and plays it out to Muller. 
which is also showing good linking play there to the centre mid to right wing. Anyways, he puts it in, which is really nicely defended by his team, which was a shame, which could have been a goal. He then uh, goes for a little run, and as you can see here, uh, Diego Alves is just a strong keeper. Schweinsteiger on the ball again, running it up the pitch. He has a long shot. You know, it didn't really come off too much, but it just shows that his shots are on target. Anyways, moving on, Tony Cruz gets a lovely dink through ball, takes on his defence, ruins them, and then does a nice finesse goal into the bottom right corner. In my opinion, it was a lovely goal from Tony Cruz. He's now on the attack and has a shot, which was, I had to add it because it was a good shot, but my keeper was on form, keeping it, you know, seeing it out, really. Anyway, Muller does a, like, a little walk through his defence, and it doesn't really come off, which was a shame. He then puts in the ball, and I don't know how that was a free kick. It was an honest attempt for the ball. I think EA just absolutely bollocks on me today. Anyways, he, I think he just kicks it out, and um, just, it just nothing really else happened. Anyways, that was the final score, 2-1. This was the team that I've been using. Anyway, guys, I really hope you enjoyed. Please comment, rate, and subscribe, and I'll see you in the next one. Peace. Check out the... Thank you.